blanket. I appreciate. Oh, there was something up there, man. Welcome to the charge. I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today with Movie Night. This game is described as a wholesome horror game. I want to know what that means just as much as you do. I'm excited you're here. Let's ride. Right on. Okay, got to prepare a few things. I'll turn this up a little bit. Maybe not that much. All right. So, feet check, no feet. That's okay. Start the microwave and place the popcorn on the tray. Grab the soda from the fridge, place it on the tray, place the tray on the table in the living room. Gotcha. I appreciate a nice, cozy-looking fireplace, and that is a really cool, um, what is that, mantle, whatever that's called. Got an old-timey TV. I doubt we can leave. Can we sprint? We can sprint. Do we have a flashlight? No, things are just a little darker. That's all right. It's pretty cool, though. I like this house. It looks cozy. It's got a lot of character. And it has bowling pins, which is always a plus. Um, and this bowling ball that has a creepy face based on the reflection, I guess. All right, what do we got? Oh, no. Can we grab whatever that is? No? Yeah, we're not going to go down there. <laughs> we're not doing that. Upstairs as well. Interesting. Pretty nice size place, I gotta say. All right, start the microwave. Gotcha. Or not. Where is it? Tray. Used. Gotcha. Oh, it's very... Like, you gotta drag it. Gotcha. Okay, start popcorn. There we go. Grab the soda from the fridge. Is that the soda? Or is that alcohol? Soda. There we go. Drop on tray. Very nice. Y'all, look at us go. You know, this already feels pretty relaxing, I gotta say. Don't know if I... Eh, let's go down there while it's all popping. Oh, the... Okay, okay. It's like... Great. Great. Oh, we can kind of move that stuff. Interesting. Don't know why this is kind of leaning haphazardly, though. I feel like that's a danger. But our popcorn's ready, and somebody opened the door. I'm guessing it was us. All right. Here. Now we have the tray. <laughs> that we're holding at this angle. And nice! Or a blanket. Or a blanket. Gotcha. I'm going to turn this up a little bit. At first, the audio was, like, really loud, but now I feel like it, it is uh, too quiet. Let's try this. Yeah, those background noises coming through nice and strong. Search? Is this a closet? Oh, oh that's right. The blankets are in the dryer. Where is that? Is that... No. Place blankets on couch... Well, when I do find them, maybe there's that like upstairs washer and dryer. We haven't been upstairs yet. Man, this atmosphere is creepy. No. The and the lighting is just it's it's low, it's hazy. Good scary movie ambiance. Okay, you said the dryer. I don't know where the dryer is, I'm going to be honest. Why did it just get quiet? Oh, that's the static from the TV. Gosh, oh, the dryer's downstairs. Right, 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 right. All right. We grab this crate with my super strength. We're so strong. Blanket. I agree. Oh, there was something up there, man. <laughs> oh, no. Help us. It looked like a Scooby-Doo chase. Yep. And the door is open. How was the front door open? I thought I locked it. I won't be able to relax until I know all openings are locked. Sure. Sure. 
Yeah, something's in here with us. Is, is that a handprint? Who could have left that? Nah, it's gotta be one of those damn teens again. Oh, lady. Ruin my movie night? <laughs> no way. Lady! This. There is something try bad in there with you. I would really consider where's the other window i would really consider calling the police doesn't hurt to call the police i'm guessing the other one's upstairs i cannot tell if this is just wall or if there's a door here i think that's just wall all right final window you know for the size of this place you'd figure we'd have more windows okay that's the last one but I didn't see any signs of someone breaking in. Ugh. I hate when the wind blows that door. This is not how a rational person reacts. <laughs> oh, oh, this is too much. I need to go sit down on the couch. I understand. Gone. How was that possible? Where could it be? I don't think it's there. Wait, what is that? Hold on. Whoops. I glitched onto the crate. Oh, we can jump. What is that? Is that like a paint can? I did all that for a paint can? Fine. We have a toilet down here. On its side. Interesting. I'm gonna guess upstairs. Or, maybe it's in the fridge? Mayhaps? Perhaps? What do we got? No. What do we even have in here? Is that popsicles? Bananas? Sodas? The, the staples of any healthy diet. Uh, okay, where else have we not checked? We haven't checked the bathroom, and then we'll, I guess, go upstairs. My guess is that it's going to be in that room that we haven't been in yet. So let's go explore. Where could it be? Where could the video go? We need to watch. Yep. All right. I'm not afraid of anything. It's dark in here, guys. Aha! Examine. Okay. Oh, okay. I guess just kind of an option. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? Is it going to kill us? Just a nightmare. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Whoa! Calm down. Calm down. Don't freak out. <laughs> I'm not human. Look, I'm not gonna hurt you. I just wanna talk. Please, don't mess with me like this. Just leave me alone. Don't worry. I won't be coming back. I won't be bothering you. Or anyone. Never again. Wait! You're really just going to leave? What is happening? Like that? Yeah. Normally I do all kinds of scary stuff. Tap on the windows, open doors, hide stuff, make you question your sanity. What? But I, I'm just going through some mental stuff right now, I guess. And um, I, Aww. Can't, I can't do this anymore. Fella, no. What? I don't want to do this anymore. I'm tired of being seen as a monster. Believe it or not, I've tried to be friendly. Tried being myself. What? Tried to show others that I'm not just a beast. But all anyone sees is a big scary creature that they scream at. So I became what people saw me as. Something to be feared. 
Something to be hated. Aww. Something that deserves to be alone. Aww. I didn't ask to be this way, you know. The people of this world have shown me that no matter what, I will always be seen. He's a little twitchy. As a monster. So maybe it's best if the world never sees me again. Well, that's really sad. I'm throwing all this at you. You didn't ask. No one does. I'll leave you be. That's really sad. What? stay watch a movie with me what really yeah i could use the company do you like romantic comedies i've never seen a movie before what we're friends now do you like romantic stories well have a seat can i get you anything water <laughs> cocoa cocoa would be lovely what What? Interesting. Okay. Uh, cocoa in the microwave. Got gotcha. you. Is it already in there? I guess so. Oh! <laughs> oh, he's fast. Oh, he's tall and he's fast and he has no face. Oh, we're kind of confined to here now. All right. And boom. There you go. Here. It's not the best, but it will warm you up. This is wonderful. It's much better than what I normally drink. What? And what's that? River water? Human blood. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you should see the look on your face. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Got me. Are you proud of yourself for that one? <laughs> I am. So, what do I call you? Do you have a name? In my native language, I am called. <laughs> Harold. 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 Harold's a good name. Strong Harold? name. Oh, she's laughing too. Nothing. You just don't look like a herald, but it's a fine name for you. He doesn't look like anything. It's a pleasure to meet you, Amanda. Thank you for being so kind to me. You're welcome. Thanks for not killing me. <laughs> don't mention it. So, if you aren't going to scare people anymore, what will you do? I had a dream once, but it'll never happen. Not for someone like me. Okay. Now you have to tell me about this dream. No, it's dumb. Hey, dreams aren't dumb, including yours. Tell me. She's so nice to him, and I appreciate that. But you can't laugh. I won't. I... I want to be a pizza delivery guy. What? Don't be I mean. Don't be mean to Harold. I, I, I'm not laughing. I'm just very surprised at your dream. Why do you want to deliver pizza? I've stalked many neighborhoods throughout my life. Sometimes I see a pizza guy going up to the houses. And I see the faces of the people who open the doors. They always look so happy to see him. I'm Team Harold here. I want this guy to succeed in life. I'd like to know how it feels to have Assuming he hasn't like killed anybody, actually. Well, Harold. I'll be excited to see you for our next movie night. Really? Yeah. This has been the most interesting movie night of my life. And we haven't even started the movie yet. Thank you, Amanda. 
wild. Anytime. Now let's just enjoy the show. Oh, weird, he gave us a little flashlight at the end. Well, that was wholesome. Okay. I enjoyed that. I thought that was a nice, fresh take on the genre. Uh, short and sweet, with a sweet ending, too. How do you like that? Uh, definitely fun. So, to Jeremy Fisher and Dylan Fisher, uh, the guys who wrote this and developed this, thank you. I appreciated how... Um, kind of, you know, relaxing that was in the end. I liked uh, that it may not always be what it seems like. So, that being said, it was a good time. Thank you again. And I want to thank you for joining the charge today. If you aren't already supporting the channel, you can by subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing, hitting the notifications, all of that good stuff all goes a long way, even if you do just one of those things. And it means the world to me. I want to thank you for joining the charge. I will see you on the next battlefield. Till then.